I'm with Jonathan Rajeski, founder and CEO of Tenteo Tequila. Now, Jonathan, Tenteo is a little bit different than other tequilas. You don't sure. have a plane, you have these wonderful infusions. Can you tell us how, how you create an infused tequila? Yeah, first uh, we do, we have three Blanco tequilas that are uh, distilled, infused, and bottled in Tequila, Mexico. And we, ha we use a state-grown blue agave, they're 100% agave. And then we use fresh natural ingredients that we buy at the local markets to do multiple infusions that are then blended back together and brought to 40%, which is by law what tequila has to be in the United States. And it's bottled and labeled and sent to the United States for your consumption. And what flavors do you have? And well, I'd love to taste them. Yeah, sure, sure. We have a um, we have our signature is our jalapeno. Um, it is organic jalapenos that come from the coast near Puerto Vallarta. We have a tropical. Um, this is infused with mango, pineapple, guanabana. Ooh, can I taste that? Sure. Um, Which one? Right is it the, this is the tropical. Yeah, this is the tropical. Um, and there's a little bit of jalapeno in there. It's the it's sort of my interpretation of the um, fresh fruit that you get in Mexico with. Um, salt and lime and a little bit of jalapeno. And what's amazing about tasting this is you don't get the artificial taste. No. Which some flavored spirits you kind of like taste color number 45. Like this actually tastes like fruits. Yeah. How, how, how do you do that? that? I mean that's that's the whole thing. I mean we, we, did, we did, did small batches and we use actual real fruit. So we pick it at the, 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 the absolute most ripe time. They left the market, they went to the factory, and then we had everybody there processing, you know, by hand, the mangoes, the pineapple, That's the guanabana, and they were going in the tank. The, the jalapenos came okay, from the I coast that day. Okay, I'm going to taste the jalapeno. Isn't yep. that, so is this pretty spicy? Should I get myself a seatbelt on? I think the jalapeno is for spicy, spice lovers, but it's formulated so that if you make a cocktail, it gets just a really kiss good. of heat. You know, it, it's great because I love jalapeno margaritas. I'm always mm -hmm. muddling fresh jalapenos. But you know, it's interesting with actual jalapenos, because they're natural vegetables or spices, they sometimes they're really hot, sometimes they're not that hot. You can actually kind of get a sense of what your cocktail is going to taste like when it's already infused. Yeah, and we've already had a number of accounts in New York City that have attempted to sort of do cocktails with fresh jalapenos and have had real problems with consistency mm -hmm. and have switched over and been really happy with Tanteo because for that precise reason. Huh. They get consistency in product all the time and, and these are accounts that are moving 10, 15, 20 cases a month. Wow. All right, now we have to try the chocolate. Yeah, tequila. and this one's pretty <laughs> special. Um, this is actually more like a mole. Um, there's no added sugar in here. We use natural raw cocoa. Um, there's a little bit of jalapeno in there also, so it's almost like our mole. Oh my gosh. And what's great is it's not sweet. Not, you know, not people sweet. would, one might think, I mean, oh my gosh, it's going to be like a sweet tequila. This is delicious. It yeah. is like a true mole, which is not overly sweet. That's right. That's so right. So you're bringing the culinary aspect to the tequila. Bring the culinary aspect to cool. the tequila. Keeping mm -hmm. it, you know, we're doing something untraditional, but we're being as traditional about it as we possibly can. Because great. we really respect the, the tequila itself and really love the spirit. And I personally, I think it's the best there is. So... Um, we're very impressive. To do I have job. to say, I'm really impressed. This is the first time I'm tasting Tenteo, and it's it's a very pleasurable experience and a great surprise because you're never quite sure what you're going to get when you're talking about flavored spirits. And I think you've done a really nice job of making them taste really natural. So yeah. that's kind of cool. Now you're going to make a drink for us here. The margarita, as you all may know out there, is the number one selling cocktail in the world, and we're going to taste the Tenteo signature margarita. Yeah. Um, as as Nelly said, the number one selling cocktail is the margarita. Um, and they're, they're very simple ingredients. You have Tanteo jalapeno, we have fresh lime juice, we have um, a little bit of orange liqueur and some agave nectar. And it really makes a difference, the ingredients that you use, just like in cooking. The best cooks, the best recipes have the best ingredients. So always use fresh lime juice um, and always use the top shelf um, mixers. And so we're gonna put those into our special ratio here, add a little bit more ice. You know, and one of the things about margaritas is that they are, tend to be a lot of alcohol in them. So I like to use lots of ice and shake very, very well. And Natalie, do you like yours on the rocks or straight up? I like it straight up without salt. There we go. That looks so good. 
I will join you. Yay! Well, we get to raise our glasses yes, to Tales of the Cocktail and thanks Tales to Tenteo Tequila for being our podcast sponsor. Great to meet you and Thank you. try these tequilas, they're really good. Cheers.